Hi folks, it's Max from uh, GalaxyNote2.com. So I've got another ROM overview of um, Blazor ROM by uh, XDA user Phantom Hacker. Um, one of the first ROMs I tried that he made was on the Galaxy Tab 10.1. Uh, it certainly was one of the best ROMs that I've tried, and uh, ever since that he's been making very good ROMs. Uh, his ROMs are pretty much based off stock, um, but adds a lot of cool additions. Um, right off the bat, when you install this ROM, you'll notice an extra YouTube app. This one allows you to download um, any any videos. You can go like this and hit the download button there. I'm not going to play the video. Um, and also ads are blocked and uh, let me see here. And also call recording is enabled in this ROM and you get the circle mod there. A lot of little things here and there. Uh, here and there. There's no 15 toggles on this one yet. Um, for the future versions, it probably will have it, or by the time you see this video. Um, so very good ROM. It comes with an uh, inverted Facebook app, which is kind of interesting. Um, just kind of a uh, interesting. And also, this comes with disabled increasing ringtone for those of you who don't like it. And also, the UI rendering is uh, with GPU. Now, if you want to get stay kind of stock, but with some of these little additions um, to the stock ROM and also smoother, uh, slightly better performance, um, definitely try out this ROM, and I think you'll like it. And uh, it should be updated more often. But uh, Phantom Hacker is known for very stable ROMs based off stock. And uh, you know, if I made a ROM, I would make something like this. So highly recommend it. Also, um, there might be some stuff I didn't mention that you might find such as like you know disabled um, camera shutter sound now when you do oh it's all disabled even for the um what is it for the continuous mode so that's really cool um, this is the blazer rom duly noted uh, for your sprint galaxy note 2 please only flash on your sprint galaxy note 2 uh, you can use twerp to install this and do make sure to do a data white factory reset um, you can try without it if you're coming from a stock rom but um, do make a backup ROM just in case. And uh, you know, if you if you don't like the Jelly Bomb ROM for some reason, maybe some of you don't like the um, highly themed um, you know ROM, or maybe you want to stay a little bit more more stock. Definitely, this is the ROM for a Blazer ROM. Um, try it out. Let me know what you think. I think you'll like it. Uh, you get to pretty much keep everything stock, but a little bit of improvement. So very good for noobs. For those of you just starting with custom ROMs definitely um, try this one out and I think you will like it a lot uh, as you know it's pretty much stock with additions um, so check it out let me know what you think of this ROM um, and uh, if you have a Galaxy Note 2 uh, don't forget to sign up for my email list at Galaxy Note 2 um, Galaxy Note 2 root.com I have links in the description um, for that email list and uh, if you sign up um, it's a great way for you to get in contact with me and others if you have trouble with your phone and uh, if you're on YouTube, please hit that like button for me here. Subscribe button out there. And uh, stay high on Android. Yeah. I'm going to go watch the football game. Go Raiders. Yeah.